So these are the things you need for servicing your Mercedes printer differential. You need a ratchet. I use a half inch. You need a 14 hex socket. This is to open and drain the diff. And the screwdriver to pop the pillow rubber cap off. And you might need a brush and some brake cleaner just to clean up the area because sometimes it can get very dirty over time so you need 75 90 just check what specs your sprinter is each one is different this one requires a 75 90 fully synthetic gear oil but just make sure you check what your one is all right we'll go underneath now and... as you can see here it's fully caked up with all dirt built up over time. I need to clean that out. Once that's cleaned, you come here to the filler. You can give that a clean as well because you don't want any dirt going into it. It's good for potentially damage your bearings. So always open the filler before you open the drain, just in case you get stuck. And you cannot open the filler, you'll be stranded. This one is dripping out oil now, so the, it's been previously overfilled. So it must have been filled at an angle. So that's probably why it's got the extra fluid in it. Little tip, never use an impact gun or similar to try and remove that unless you really have to. I forgot to mention before, you also need a torque wrench of something similar because you have to torque this down to 100 newton meters. Again, just check your specs because each Mercedes printer has a different type of axle fitted to it and each one has its own indication as to the tightness. Next you can take your bottle and begin filling up the diff. So the manual says to fill it just below the filler line. I like to just fill it till a drip or two comes up. Then you know it's completely full. And you wipe it, it still drips. That means it's full. That's it, and you're all done.